Hi, I'm Scott Humphrey, CEO of the World Floor Covering Association, and this is Leadership Live. And this week on The Lead Story, I want to talk about facing the difficulty of change. First, let me ask you a simple question. Can we acknowledge that change can be difficult? Can we also acknowledge that as we get older, we get more set in our ways and change becomes even more challenging? Some industries, like the flooring industry, I find, is historically resistant to change. Uh, for, for instance, we will hate the situation we're in, but we will fight changing it to make it better. And you may be in one of those types of industries as well. And I want to challenge you by sharing with you a story of somebody who has faced the challenge in a traditional environment where rules are preset and been able to have phenomenal success. His name is Jesse Cole, and he is the owner of the Savannah Bananas. Now, you may be familiar with them if you've seen one of their TikToks or if you've been on YouTube and seen one of their videos. They have dramatically changed the way that baseball is played. Let me give you a little history. Jesse was a baseball player himself. In fact, he was a, a pretty good pitcher until he tore his labrum, I think in his senior year. And because of that, pitching was not an option, so baseball wasn't either. And yet that had been the thing he had thought about doing his whole life. And so Jesse decided the natural thing to do would be to coach. But he said as he began to coach, he was haunted by the fact that the game bored him to tears. And he thought, as a coach, if it bores me that much, I wonder what it does to the fans. And, and how many fans chose not to come to the game because it was too boring to them? He set out to change a very traditional game that had a preset number of rules and make it more fan-friendly. Jesse and his wife, Emily, went through some challenging times because change can be difficult. In fact, at one point, they had to sell their house to keep the team afloat. They moved into a one-bedroom apartment with a blow-up mattress, and that was their life. But they were so committed to the change that they were willing to do just that. See, he realized that spectators want action, that in today's society, we expect results more quickly, and so he looked at how they could speed the game up. For instance... At the beginning of the game with the Savannah Bananas, they say start the clock and the game lasts exactly two hours unless they go into sudden death. If you get four balls, you don't walk to first base, you sprint and you continue to run until every defensive player on the field has touched the ball, then you have to stop. I mean, he looked at ways that they could involve the fans. For instance, if you hit a foul ball and a fan catches the foul ball, it's an out. And unlike the Harlem Globetrotters, the Savannah Bananas actually compete. They don't know if they're going to win every game. They have another team that plays against them that has, they have to follow the same different rules, but they can, they can win. It's dramatically different. How has it gone over? Well, they, they recently did a world tour, kind of in 2022, to sold out arenas all over the United States. In fact, they have 600,000 people on a waiting list for tickets to see the Savannah Bananas. Is change possible? You bet it is. Can change be difficult? Yes. What does it take to persevere? A commitment that there must be a better way. Now, let me transition this into the flooring industry. If you're a part of the flooring industry, we have an opportunity right now through the FCEF to change the way we treat the installation trade to elevate it to a level of professionalism by bringing new people in and telling them a new story and giving them a goal with their life. That's what the FCEF is all about. It's about trying to change an industry that has fought with the same issue for 50 plus years and never been able to conquer it. And yet Jim Aaron and Kay Whitener are constantly fighting this battle and still challenged because there's a lot of people in the industry that hate where we are but they're not willing to commit financially or otherwise to get us where we need to be. I want to tell you, whether it's in your personal life or your professional life, you're going to come up against challenges that will cause you to face change. Change of established criteria. And yet, if you're convinced that it can be different and that different is better, and if you're willing to stick with it, you can achieve success. You don't believe me? Just read Banana Ball by Jesse Cole. Listen, this is an amazing story. I have been fascinated. I listened to this on Audible last night till four in the morning. It's a great story. 
so is the one you're riding with your life. Now go out there and live the story that you want other people to tell.